iOS 26 maps, preferred routes, and visited places. Game changers or privacy concerns? Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the latest buzz around Apple Maps in the upcoming iOS 26. Apple's promising some exciting new features, preferred routes and visited places, along with a fresh liquid glass redesign. Are these genuine upgrades or potential pitfalls? Let's break it down! First up, preferred routes. Imagine your Maps app learning your daily commute and proactively telling you about traffic snags before you even hit the road. Key route info will even pop up right on your home screen in the suggestions widget. Think about saving precious minutes on your way to work just by getting a heads up about a jam. But what if Maps doesn't quite nail your preferred routes? And will these constant alerts become annoying? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Next, we have Visited Places. This feature automatically logs the restaurants, shops, and other spots you've been to in a new Visits menu, no manual check-ins needed. Ever forget that amazing little cafe you stumbled upon last month? This could be a lifesaver for rediscovering hidden gems. Apple is emphasizing on device intelligence for preferred routes and end-to-end -end encryption for visited places, which is a big plus for privacy-conscious users. Despite the encryption, some might still feel uneasy about their location history being automatically tracked. Where do you stand on this? Now, it's not all smooth sailing. Some beta users are raising usability concerns, like street names disappearing when zooming and difficulties in customizing navigation defaults. And while the liquid glass redesign sounds sleek, any major UI change can have its quirks. We'll have to see how intuitive the new look and feel truly are. So, are the new Apple Maps features in iOS 26 a game changer or something to be cautious about? The proactive alerts and automatic visit logging are certainly intriguing, but usability and privacy perceptions will be key. What are your initial thoughts? Are you excited about these updates? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more tech news and updates. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.